What's up everybody, Wolf here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet video. Um, in today's video we're going to be playing with a Mewtwo Gen 1 base team. I did a poll a few days ago uh, asking everyone who their favorite was between Mewtwo and Mew, and well, Mewtwo, uh, I wouldn't say it won by landslide, but it definitely won with the most votes. So that's what we're going to be playing with today is uh, Mewtwo. Now. I could be doing the regular boring, you know, Calm Mind or Nasty Plot Mewtwo and just doing the regular one. I was like, you know what? We've not had the Megas in so long to play the physical version. I'm going to try a physical version. So as you can see, my Mewtwo is got Zen Headbutt, Earthquake, Terra Blast, and Bulk Up. Um, we are Terra Fire, just so, you know, I can uh, cover some of my weaknesses. Um... You know, maybe surprise somebody, because Terra's just can throw anybody off. Uh, we are max attack, max speed. And yeah, so then we've got Dragonite. We've got... Uh, the Zepdos is a little different. It's like a bulky version. It's mostly just there to get off discharges and kind of whittle them down. We've got Classic Cloyster. Uh, I'm going to try the Gengar again with the Toxic Spikes. Hopefully we don't run into the same issue that we did last time. And then we'll have Arcanine. Which, the Arcanine is also a special belt. As you can see, it's got Flamethrower. Uh, it's more of like a, a tanky version. So, like, we, we can cripple them with Burn. We can use Spam Snarl to lower their special attack. And if we don't want them setting up on us, we can just roar them away. So, got some weird builds we're playing with today. We'll see how it goes. But with all that, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. And let's go find some matches. Alright, let's see what our opponent is rocking. Uh, let's see here. They've got a pretty they got a pretty decent team. The Garnacle always terrifies me and always will. Um I'm trying to think of like what I could get away with here. Okay, so they don't have a poison type, so we can do this. I don't think anything learns rapid spin, but the uh Corviknight could have uh like defog. I don't know. We'll, we'll just have to find out together. Um, but yeah, I think this is what I want to go with. Yeah, I, I think. So, we've got a potential for quite a few things that our team can do, so we'll see. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'm happy with this. Both our teams are pretty well balanced, so we will see what happens. The Iron Valiant could be physical or special, that kind of throws me off, so with the Dragapult. But everything else should still be like, kind of like what it always is. It just depends on what he's leading with. This stupid thing. I'm actually going to go with a Taunt. I don't want this thing setting up on me, I don't want it doing nothing. And now he might just go for a salt cure. I don't know. No, he just goes for the earthquake. That is completely fair. It wasn't even enough to uh, KO me. Alright, so he's just going for another earthquake. That's different to see on a Garnacle. Alright, what do we want to do now? I think we'll bring in the Dragonite and we'll try from here and see what happens. Now, he's most likely probably going to have uh, Salt Cure. I am wearing Weakness Policy, so if we get hit by a Super Effective, then, you know, hey, go us. Oh, are you stuck in... Uh, Hmm, I don't know if I want to be greedy, though. Like, a, Yeah, I don't know if I want to be greedy. I think I'll just go for... I'll go for an Earthquake. I mean, I still did quite a bit of damage. Now, yeah, there it is. I still did a lot of... Oh, he crit hit me. I was like, that did a lot of damage. 
There's the weakness policy, but now we're on a time limit. I freaking hate Salt Cure. The only benefit that we have is we're not, um, we're not fighting, or we're not water or steel, so it's not going to be, like, eating through my HP, but... Alright, so now I'm just going to test to see if he's going to do, like, Earthquake or something. You don't have a flyer on your team, do you? You do. But if I can get rid of this thing, that will make me happy. What do you protect? Nope. Okay, so I'm rid of this. I'll have to switch out Dragonite now, though, because I don't want it to die. Or I could just let Dragonite run its course. Because we are doing a lot of damage with Dragonite right now, so... Cupid. Well, here's the thing, though. Your speed might be heightened, but it doesn't outgo by extreme speed, so... Yeah. Where it's worth the KO. Dragonite did its job. It got rid of the Garnacle, and this thing is, uh, yeah. Yep, there we go, see? We're, we're in the seatbelt. We're winning. Alright, so now what do we want to bring in? You know what, let's try Mewtwo, why not? It was the whole point of being voted on, so let's play with Mewtwo. I mean, technically we're tied right now. We both have a KO'd Pokemon. Or two KO'd Pokemon. So technically, I guess it'll be anyone's game. It's just I have to be poisoning everything when it comes in uh, into play. Now, he's going to be, like, way faster than me. And I don't know what type of... Uh, move it's rocking. I really don't win this like at all. And it's hmm. We didn't I didn't see if it had a clear body or not. That's the problem. I just don't want to take a dragon darts to the face. Maybe he uses phantom force or something. I'm faster? Wasn't expecting that. Goes for Hex. That still did a lot of damage to us. Alright. We're gonna Terra Mewtwo, cause, uh, yeah. And we'll go for a Zen Headbutt. I don't know if it'll KO, like, Dragon Bolt doesn't have, like, the best defenses, but, I mean, it's still got, you know, really nice stats. It's a pseudo-Pokemon, so. It also means if I, if I miss or not, because we do have a 9% accuracy move, so. Okay, at least we connect. Not enough to, f I mean, it's not super effective this time, at least. That's <laughs> how so we live it. You're still alive. That's the problem. Um, let's just go for an earthquake. Well, that's kind of cool how Mewtwo cast that. That was a new type of animation to see from Mewtwo. We're almost back above half. <laughs> yeah, I was not expecting it to be a hex version. Champ. What is Champ? Alright, so, here's the thing. I feel like if I... Oh, we're physical. That's the only problem here. Let's see how much this does. I mean, it still did a pretty good chunk, so... 
He just goes for a body press. And my defense is probably equal or higher than yours after the boost, so... <laughs> you do watching it fly up and down. I have leftovers. Yeah, I think we'll just go for another one of these. We should KO it. Hey, Mewtwo's coming in for the sweep. Physical Mewtwo hanging in there. Now, obviously, if we were a special belt, this would be way easier because, like, Mewtwo's special tech is crazy high. Leftovers keeping us in the game. Alright, he's not teared yet, so I don't know what this thing's going to be. The Toxic is really funny, though. Alright, we do have Earthquake for this thing, so... Nice. Mewtwo getting his sweep in. We're almost back to half. <laughs> Alright, what's your last Pokemon? He's still not teared yet. We're only down two and Mewtwo's below half. Come on, uh, is the... Oh boy, Sizzler's going to enjoy this uh, Terra Blast. They might tear it here though. Yep, there we go. I wonder what typing it is. Please be still or bug. That'd be hilarious. For me. It's water. I mean, we pretty much resist all of its moves except for like Aerial Ace, if he's running that. Yeah, that did like nothing. Counter? Oh! Wasn't expecting that. Well, there goes Mewtwo. <laughs> but it's okay. I've got Zapdos for this. Yeah, just enjoy the discharge. But GG for him trying. He KO'd half my team, though. But hey, Mewtwo phys physical Mewtwo actually did some work. Uh, maybe if we could have got, like, one more bulk up in there, we could have done some, like, a lot more, like, outgoing damage. But I, didn't, I don't think it ever mattered against the Sizzle where he was going to want to with the counter in anyways. But there we go, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video with Mewtwo. Physical Mewtwo. And, um, yeah. So, I think I have another poll going on right now where I have the Galarian trio up of Zapdos, Articuno, and Moltres. So, whichever one of them wins in the next few days is what we'll do another team based around them. So, normally how I want to do these polls, uh, I try to do a theme team with the poll Pokemon that wins. So, like, obviously with Mewtwo, I just did a full Gen 1 Pokemon team. So, if the Galarian ones win, I'll either do, like, a, a same type team as them, or I'll only use Pokemon from Sword and Shield. It just depends on what mood I'm in and wanting to build or play with. So, and also, a lot of these Pokemon that you guys are voting on, I try to build completely different than what they're normally used for. Just to see if we can make it work. And I feel like Physical Mewtwo could have, it, was, it wasn't too bad. And I think if I had just done, like, one more bulk up, we would have been, like, solid. But, who knows? But thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Leave a like on the video if you did. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.